my level's four. Uh, so yep, Mario 3, 3-3. Three -three. So this fish can actually eat you, and I don't think you can jump on him. You have to throw a shell at him or something. I think also firepower would work. Oh, we just dodged that. Uh, but as you'll see from Feast of Felis Caddis, there will also be fish that harass me and water that goes up and down. Uh, mine is going to be a little bit longer than that, but that is what I base it on. by Mario 3, again, 3-3. Three -three. So, yeah, let's get, in, let's get into it. This is one of the ones where the water goes up and down and there are fish that can eat you regardless of what your power-up is. And kind of like the Mario 3 level that I had with the dry bone shell. This is a power up level where my intent is not to make it easier by giving you more power ups all the time, but my intent is that you are always Cat Mario throughout the entire level. And hence the name Feast of Felis Catus. Felis Catus, of course, being the scientific name for Cow's Cat. And it is a a nod to uh, Star Trek. Data had a cat named Spot. And wrote a poem about him. Which is why the uh, description of the level is an endothermic quadruped, carnivorous by nature. And I will link that in the description as well. And hopefully a link to that so you know what I'm talking about in case you haven't seen TNG. Definitely one of the funniest parts of that entire Star Trek series. You have an android trying to write poetry and it's completely hilarious. So gotta dig this out, and you get a you get a uh, one up there. Almost died there. It's always better to kill the fish so that they can't harass you as much. So this one, you have to wait for the water level to rise, so that you can enter the pipe there. And now we're being harassed by bigger and bigger fish. Got him. So if you time it just right, you can still get them like that. And when you kill them, they can't harass you anymore. Now in Mario 3 World 3-3, they would respawn. Uh, and that's not the case here unless you get away from their spawn point enough. Uh, now this is a risky thing, right? Because now the fish is over here. He's going to respawn right away as you get through that door. But I know where to stand because I designed the level. I stand right here. And you spam the swipe. Stand under him and you got him. But now he re-respawns. And I just got eaten. So that's what happens. Okay, uh, I'm not going to talk for this. I'm just going to try to clear it. So I'm going to go quiet for a second while I try to do this. So I think it's uh, also fine to power level your way through this as well, but I don't know. It kind of feels like cheating to me. 
But I think I'm about to do exactly that. And this is the celebration room. It's all the fish getting ground up after you've eaten them. All the bones of the fish. And then you have a little light platforming ending area. Uh, sweet. That's the Feast of Felis Catus. Course ID on the screen and level code, which is the same thing, of course, in the description.